Hey everybody, this is Ben, and welcome back to Timber and Stone, and we are paused currently, because um, as always, I'm trying to run through and get a little bit more progress done on these walls, um, but when I, uh, I, I last left off, uh, yeah, we've been working on these outer walls, which are looking great, by the way, I'll go over that pretty soon here. Now, where is my goblin there? Okay, there we go. Connor B. That's what I was looking for. We got goblins. I, I had looked around. Okay, let me fix my camera real quick. There we go. A uh, goblin marauder. Spotted by... Oh! There's a goblin marauder right... Holy cow! Is that Connor? That's Connor. Connor, you're my soldier dude, right? Yes. Okay. Um, I don't like you taking on a marauder alone, but... Um, where's everyone else? <laughs> uh, let me take a look at my designations. All right, so what I've got going here is with this wall, uh, so all the way around this side of the place, I've got a two block high wall already, um, all the way back to about here. You can see there's a couple of little spots. So I've, for the large part here already, and um, Wade Dryden here, he is working working hard or hardly working, you know, he's he's on it, he's building the wall going around there. I think I might have one or two other builders. I don't know where everyone is at. I just loaded up and had these goblins. So let's go ahead and take a quick look. Where are my infantry? I have a whole bunch of them. <laughs> so it shouldn't be a problem. Wow. Why do I have so many of them? I'm not sure. So get funked. How about you? What are you, what are you up to? Okay, you're you are not meant to be infantry permanently, I do not believe, because you are not equipped to be one. You were just training. Um, so you, hmm. All right, we're gonna have to, let's, let's go through these. All right, we're infantry. So Ninja Nate, you are clearly a minor. You've, uh, these people have maxed out their training. That's why they're 11. All right, so you're a minor. Get funked. You kind of look like you're either a minor or a wood chopper. Yeah, you're my wood chopper. All right, let's see who else we got. Connor B. You, oh gosh. Okay, Copple, you are a, probably a builder or a miner. I'm gonna make you a miner. All right, so my, uh, is it Margaret is one of my my soldiers here? No, ah, oh, shoot. <laughs> uh, let's look through, where are my soldiers? Where are my soldiers? Who is this? Thiago. You're a uh, forager. Yeah, that's why you have that stuff. Okay. All right, Brunhilda, obviously. Infantry, captain of the guard. And a couple. Here we go. Mirazors. Mirazor stick infantry. Great. Yes, you should be doing that. Standard guard positions. Very good. Okay, so he's a level 10. That's why I didn't see him there. All right, so... My other person, who is infantry and is on 11, <laughs> he's gotten pushed down on Marizor, sorry. Uh, yeah, Margaret Morgan here. Who are you, what do you do? You're hard worker, courageous, and clumsy. Courageous, I have heard, is good for soldiers. So perhaps you will be another dedicated soldier. Because I'm gonna need one for, for stuff coming up here. All right, let's get you armored up real quick. Sword, good armor. Um, I can't remember which of these I have. He heavy chest, heavy boots, uh, shield if you can find one. And is it a light helm or a heavy helm? What do I have? What am I looking? I have a spangen helm, right? That's light. I guess that's light. I don't have any of these heavier ones. All right, light helm it is. Oops, shoot. Okay, we're gonna get going in just a sec. <laughs> Margaret. Light helm. Okay, cool. All right, there we go. So Margaret can armor up, and hopefully Connor can handle this down here. He's got, uh, yeah, pretty good, pretty good stuff. You got, yeah, he's supposed to be grabbing a shield. I need to make shields, but let's just get moving here on the uh, attack. There you go. Come on, catch him, catch him. You're so damn slow. Ooh, 11. Nice. Gather resources. All right. So he hangs out at a guard position here. 
Oh, they're all coming out to hang out the guard positions. I think I just set these up. Um, so there we go. So with the wall up, I just have everybody sitting around here on guard position. They can all just sit around the gate, and that will totally, totally do us fine. Um, as I was saying, though, there are goblins kind of all over the place. And, Wade, what, what are you doing, man? Get over here. Finish this little spot here. Don't leave the wall. Don't leave big holes in the wall. It's not a good way to build a wall. Oh, he's waiting on the uh, stonemasons to build stuff. That's why. Right. So it's, it's slow going. Okay, so, you couldn't watch your desired target? Okay, uh, seek charge. Good. Seek charge. I don't know who I picked before. Pay attention, Ben. Pay attention. Seek charge. Seek charge. Okay, great. Oh, where's, uh, Margaret? I didn't set your stuff. Seek charge. Stand at guard positions. Great. Okay, Mirzor spotted him. Excellent. Oh, we got some nice combat music. Everybody's coming out. Oh, yeah. Bang, bang, bang. And he's dead. So nice. Yep, gather those resources. Gather them up. So, I am not too bothered by the goblins, I guess. <laughs> they settled pretty nearby. There's their little campfire. So, let's, let's see if I can just use the seek charge option. Because they're all set to guard and seek charge enemies. Here's another one. Oh, but he hasn't been spotted. Dang it. All right, so... Oh, it looks like we have a migrant coming in. Nice. So, we need to get... Get that going. How's my mining up here looking, by the way? Okay, there. Is that... Is that Margaret? That's Margaret. What do you got? Excellent. You're... You're kitted out. You're looking as good as any of these schmucks. <laughs> Hard worker, bad vision, charismatic, and clumsy. Nice. Bad vision, that's exactly it. Courageous and athletic, Murazor. You're a good infantry choice. Wow. Just by luck, too. Charismatic. Courageous. All right, so we've got a couple of good people here. Oh, Goblin Ravager has been spotted by Tiago. Where? No, that one's... Oh, over here. Cool. All right, well, now I can charge this enemy. Great, let's see. Yeah, look at that. All four of them. Beautiful. Oh, man, look at that. Yeah, go after that stupid settler. Oh no, you should not. You should not do that. He's running away, isn't he? <laughs> this one's gonna kill him, whoever the heck that is. The only one that can catch him. <laughs> really delayed, but he's afraid. That is so crazy. I sent too many people after him. All right, maybe I should set one of these people Brunhilda, you're the slowest. You have the shield. Why don't I set you not to seek charge target enemy? All right, there you go. So he's going to go back, and he's dead. <laughs> okay, Brunhilda, you go back. You can, you're can. you captain of the guard. You just stand guard. That's your job. Okay, cool. Wade took care of that little breach in the wall that he never filled in. So now we've got a wall all the way from over to here. So the only way of getting in other than the gate is from here to here essentially yeah sweet just just this side right here and this is a very small corner so i feel pretty secure in that cool looking good looking good so yeah what uh, what's see what do you guys think um i'm liking the the shape it's starting out to be gonna have a nice big tower here um i think i might put a warehouse in this area somewhere or maybe back here i don't know it's hard to say oh there we go joanna stonemason and traits see i should pay attention to these traits this is when i should do this <laughs> lazy all right so like what can you do you're a minor well obviously the very first thing that anyone should do when they join is be given um, a sword, there you go, set to infantry, and combat training, there you go, beautiful, yeah, we're gonna make sure we got a lot of competent people 
with uh, able to use weapons. So Joanna's accepted. And speaking of accepted, that reminded me, I actually only have a single new name request. So I should have plenty of people here. Uh, name request is from Felipe. And apologies here for this. Serenu? Sir, 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 Sirenu. Sirenu. We're going to go with that. <laughs> so, um, it looks like who do we got that's available? Uh, we have Joanna, Margaret, and Robert. And Robert is a builder. So, Felipe, let's, let's make you Robert. There you are, man. So, and he said, his comment, he says, name request, please. Anything is fine, really. Great. Well, Felipe Sirenu. Sirenu. Sirenu? Sirenu. I'll go with that. Why not? <laughs> uh, I just, you know, I'm doing my best. Felipe Sirenu. Welcome to the settlement. Just triple checking my spelling. All right, cool. Cool, Felipe Cyrano. All right, and that's yeah, that's the only one I got to add for uh, this episode. Um, anybody else has a name request? I do have a couple of uh, ladies open on <laughs> name requests, but uh, um, yeah, other than that, you know, I'm glad we're still getting migrants though. That's a that's a good thing. Oh, I should check out my my engineer. Oops, you're level. He's level eight. He's level eight. Oh my gosh. Do you know what that means, everyone? Some of you might know what that means. Many of you might know what that means. Objects, doors, castle gate. Oh yeah, all right. So which way does this open? Does, should a castle gate open inward? I don't see any clues on this outline as to, oh wait, well, I can't make it open that way. Well, there's a clue. <laughs> <laughs> all right well i hope i have a feeling this might look a little odd it might be a little bit backwards but that's okay level seven engineer he needs six standard ingots eight strong timber and here we go Cenaris tinker we're gonna have a gate everyone <laughs> i am really happy about that that's some good news oh i hope i don't have to put this one in backwards down here. No, I shouldn't. I shouldn't have to. Don't make me. Uh, this one I want to be the arched style, so let's see if I can quick door castle arch gate. Oh, look at that. That's a lovely little thing right there. Okay, cool. And this one I'm pretty sure should open this way. We're gonna do it that way. All right, so as soon as the uh, lazy old engineer, uh, let's actually move into fast forward. So he gets going. He's very laden down. He's got a sword and he's got a whole bunch of junk on him. All right, here we go. He's building the gate. He's building the gate. It's not gonna just be a hole in the wall. Oh, nice. Okay, cool. That's just completely, they made it the same on both sides. Nice, 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 nice. All right, well now I feel like I can actually like do something to sort of finish off this wall up here. Maybe maybe I should do that. Yeah. Hmm. Well, not not right now, I guess I'm going to say because that's going to put a strain on my stone masons. I need to dedicate some more people to stone stone masonry. Oh. Felipe. How on earth have you spotted a goblin archer? Where are you working? Oh, you're right over there. Okay, cool. He's safe. No problem. Goblin Archer. Got it. Weird. No. Charge this enemy. No sweat. I think you're going to Archer your way. Oh, you missed. I think someone took one. One of you. Was it Connor? Took a sliver of, of hurt there. Bam. Everybody's going back. Got four guards total, so it looks like one of them must have gone to sleep. Um, oh, that's what I can build over here. A guardhouse. Awesome. Next project, guardhouse. So I really want him to come build the Cenaris. Cenaris, get down here and build this gate. Where'd he go? 
Oh, we don't have the materials. Do I have a carpenter? I do not have a carpenter. Wade, you're my carpenter. And that's cool, actually, because uh, builder-wise, I have Felipe as a builder now. So, Wade, I think you are going to be relegated to pretty much strictly carpenter duties. There's, I mean, if you look at this, no one else is, is worth a damn as a carpenter. It's pretty, pretty clear-cut who I have to pick for this job. Builder-wise, uh, Thiago, but then he's a forager. Um, yeah, so I think we're doing pretty good. We're getting uh, down to specialization. I feel like I have enough people. No, no fishing at all, though, of course. We are, we are a landlocked kingdom. So, yeah, we just need some more strong timber, and then we, it'll continue. Oh, we got another another goblin archer down here. They, they just keep coming up to the gate. That would be sweet. Because <laughs> I've got I've got them. i got them in trouble. All right, so guard, guard house. So if I just, am I just going to have the four or what? Hmm. i got to be careful how I design this as well. But, uh... I'll do a little bit of work towards that. Not too much. I want to. I think I'm gonna do that on camera. Oh, cool! There we go. Sinaris is coming to build this gate. This is how we cap off the episode, everybody. So, thank you so much, everyone, for watching. This has been a momentous episode of Timber and Stone. Oh, and Sinaris spots the Goblin Archer. Great, great timing. Not that one. No, gather that. Uh, that one. Yes, charge that enemy. All right, cool. Just charge him. Don't let him come after Sinaris. <laughs> Excellent. And boom! Look at that. Look at that gate. Oh my gosh. Both of you guys are plenty healthy. Excellent. Gather those two, Diago. Um, okay, so I don't see... Yeah, that's that's actually a really good design idea, is you don't have any um, any side-specific stuff on the gates. Because that's that kind of... I know I did that way back in the day. Put a gate up backwards so that like the crossbar for locking it was on the outside, and that annoyed me to hell so i had to just scrap the gate and completely lose the materials and rebuild it so that's nice that they they changed that that is just that is like friggin gorgeous holy cow i have to figure out how to do any kind of arch over the top of it but yeah it's sweet that's a sweet gate so yeah thanks everybody for watching and i will catch you in the next episode when i am gonna get going um hopefully this outer wall is gonna get closer done and then we're gonna do start building some little stuff down here i think i can do like i said a guard house down here and dedicate some beds to these guys they'll actually be well rested and comfortable yeah be be awesome they're they're the guard though so they they're kind of barracks like so and we'll we'll, we'll we'll figure that out we'll have to figure that out i'll see you all in the next time